Hey guys, it's Brandy. I'm here with some haul videos. I kind of lied last video and said that that was going to be my last haul video of the year, but um, some people have been having some sales, and I got this thing here, which I will be share sharing with you. Uh, but something I've been working on um, that I'll share with you guys is um, I'm actually trying to get my craft room organized, get my stamps organized. Uh, that way I can make videos and it's easier to tell you what I have. So like, um, these will be in like a Halloween section in my stamps. And I've been labeling like the brand and what it's called. So like Tim Holtz Halloween and then like this one's Inka Dink Clean Diver Delivery Labels. Stuff like that. So I've been working on labeling my stamps. But, um... Back to my haul video, I have something from Michaels, something from Scrapbooking for Less, and then I ordered this off a Facebook garage sale site. Um, I've been wanting this binder for a while now, and it's for Santoro uh, mini stamps. Um, it's a collector's rubber stamp storage case, and um, I can never find it. It's always out of stock. And... I asked for it in one of the rubber stamp uh, grad sale sites where they resell uh, stamps and all that stuff. And a lady had this and I went ahead and got it because it was cheaper than eBay. Uh, it is quite pricey but um, I've been wanting it so I went ahead and splurged and did it. So, um, and these are the only two stamps I own so far and there's like 40 of them. So f I think there's 40 total. There might be 60 now. I can't remember but I think there might be 60. But, um, and sorry if my voice sounds a little raspy, I've been sick over the past couple days, so I got in some Christmas card making, because I stayed home from work one day, so I got into that, which I will be sure to share that with you guys when I get them done. But, um, back to this, um, this is just a stamp binder, and normally it comes with stamp number one, but this one did not, so the lady already told me that before I bought it, just to see if I'd still be interested. But it's for the gorgeous girls. And I absolutely am so excited. I can't wait to use this. Let me see if I can get this. Off. And one lady, I seen a video on YouTube. That's how I found out about this um, binder thing. But one lady said that actually... Um, Santoro, all their packaging material, like this for instance, you can like reuse for like your scrapbooks. So I'm looking forward to that. So reuse the packaging material. So here's the whole binder. It's pretty thick. Um, it's got the gorgeous girls all over them. Let me just unzip it. And inside comes with um, the packaging, the pockets and stuff for your um, stamps. But each one, like, like this one is number four, forget me not, and it will go in here. And you can leave it in the packaging if you want, or you can take this out and just stick it in the pocket by itself. And then each one, I don't know if you guys can see this, let me see. There we go. Each one has like a different um, background on the back. So, and I just think they're so gorgeous. Like they are so pretty. I cannot wait to own all of these. So I think these will be really good for cards and all that. But this is just a place to store my stamps. And you can get more dividers online, like the um, Santoro uh, sleeves. And so, because you can go up to, I think there's like, I seriously think there's 60 stamps now. I know there's at least 40. But um, they come in sets like 1 through 20 um, on these pockets here. Like 1 through 20, and then there's like 20, 21 through 40, and then I think they just came out with a new set of uh, Gorgeous Girls. So, that's what this is all about. Um, it's just a collector case, so 
looking forward to collecting more of these stamps. But right now I only own like number four and number 16. So, and you can get these at the Santoro website or Grazel sites or I got mine at an expo. So, this thing's pretty, uh, pretty nice. And then like it has a little label thing down here. But, yeah, this is my little binder. So that's uh, my online haul that I got. Um, and then now I'm going to show you what I got at Michael's today. So it all started because I found some paper on the YouTube that I actually, no, actually I fell in love with it a couple weeks ago when I went to Michael's, but it, the Hot Buy paper pads. Those were like $20, and I wasn't about ready to spend that because I know they go on sale a lot. So I waited till they went on sale, and then I found uh, one of the paper pads that I wanted, and then another funny one. And then eventually, <coughs> oh, excuse me, um, I'll get the one, the, another one that I want. The other one that I'm looking for is uh, Baby's First Year, so I'm looking forward to that. But um, I got all these trims. They're originally... $3.99 and I got them 80% off so I got this one I got a white one and they're different they're for Halloween so this one's an angel this one's a witch this one's a princess this one's a unicorn and then I got two of the superhero ones because I figured these would be good for 4th of July and I'm planning on doing some pictures of my daughter for the 4th of July in shadow boxes and stuff. So I thought this would come in handy. So I went ahead and grabbed two of those just in case they didn't have any later. So I got those. And then I got my Copic marker that I normally get when I go there. I grab one at a time. And I use a 60% off coupon from Joann's. So they take Joann coupons. So I went ahead and used 60% off for this. And then I got this uh, wood veneer set, and it was only like 70, 69 cents. And it's a door, and it comes with uh, three different uh, wooden little words there. And then I got a three-pack of uh, the uh, shadow box frames, smaller ones. And I'm going to do some Christmas presents with this. And then this is the paper pad that I fell in love with uh, that I seen somebody else post. It's called North Pole Gazette. Let me get some of this stuff off here. And it's really, really pretty. Like It's a hot buy, so it's on sale this week. And here's some of the patterns. And I just kind of fell in love with it. It's not super bright. It's not goldy or... Like, I'm not a big fan of gold. Like, some gold's okay. But, um, it's just really pretty. I liked the prints. So, I'm looking forward to using these on my Christmas cards. And then the other Hot Buy paper pack I got is called Pun Intended. Oh, and in case you guys didn't catch it, it was North, North Pole Gazette is the other one. But this one's pun intended. So I thought it was pretty funny. Um, see pizza on there. And you amaze me. And it's got like a maze on it. Uh, Friday. It's got fries. Got some kitties. One cool chick. Unicorns. I have no idea what I'm doing. Dope, and it's oh, avocado dope, avocado dope. Yeah, uh, slow your roll. And it's got a sloth. Look at that watermelon one. That one's kind of cool. And then uh, mermaids. So I just thought this was funny and cute. So there's that banana none of your business and then I prefer my puns intended so I thought that was pretty funny so I grabbed that so that's all I got at Michael's 
and then I got an order from Scrapbooking for Less. They're having a Black Friday sale. Um, in case you guys didn't know, it's Scrapbooking dash dash less. No, Scrapbooking dash for f f o r dash less dot com. And all their some of their sticker cardstock sticker sheets are a dollar. So they're normally three fifty each, and I got them for a dollar each. So we'll go through my order that I got. And I just got this in the mail. I got a glittery piece of paper, Christmas basics, Christmas peppermint, and I did not order this, so this must be like a little gift. And then here's my order that I got. And then I got this uh, Wicked stamps or this Wicked sticker set. Thought that'd be good for Halloween pictures. And then I got these little um, stickers here. Thought those were pretty. And then I got this one for Explore. Then this one, Partners in Crime. One in a million. Everything's better when with a friend. Then I got two of these alphas. Just because uh, in case I run out of letters or whatever, I needed two of them. So I figured for a dollar each, not bad. Then I got this one for birthdays. Then this one I thought was good for summer. So I went ahead and grabbed this one. And it's like chipboard. It's stickers. Chipboard stickers. So. And these are cardstock stickers. So they're thicker. Oh, I haven't pulled them out yet. Let's see. Here we go. Alright, I got this one. This one's called Star Student. And it's got alphas and it's got glasses. Dear math, grow up and solve your own problems. My husband would love that because he's not a real big math guy. So there's that. And then I got this one. It's called The Story of Our Family, it looks like. Right there. You guys can see it. And then it has alphas on it. And then all of these little stickers here. And then I got this one, Simply Sweet. I think that's what it's called, Element Stickers. And it's got this for daughter, mother, happy girl. This would be perfect for my daughter's scrapbooks so grabbed one of those then I grabbed this one this one's called Jack and Jill I thought this was absolutely gorgeous like look at this little typewriter here my husband's seen a typewriter there at Michael's those we are memory keeper ones and he fell in love with them he was pretty excited about it he was typing away on it, so maybe one day I'll own it since he got pretty excited about it. So girls will be girls. It's got a carousel horse. And then I got this one. This one's called Hello Winter. It's got alphas and then baby it's cold outside. Love you so very much. Uh, winter is mitten weather. Walking in a winter wonderland. So this will be good for like Christmas layout and such. So, there's this one. And then if you guys want to take a look at my Instagram account, I will have put pictures of all these, two of all my finds. So, if you guys need to, if you guys need a closer up look of any of these, just comment below and I'll be sure to share a photo of the pic stickers. This one's called Hello Summer. So, and I thought it was really pretty colors. I love the bright colors of it and the Hello Summer 
life is good in the summer. So we, we took some lots of pictures this summer of, with my daughter. So I figure I'll be using that. And then this one, I think, yep, I grabbed two of these. So this one is just called Fine and Dandy. Right there. And the reason why I grabbed two of them is because of this little camper right here. I don't know why, but I'm a little obsessed with campers. So, what a beautiful life. Simply sweet, happy little moments. Friends forever. So, I grabbed two of those. And then I grabbed this one. It's birthday wishes. It's got alphas. And then it's got like happy birthday. It's got a clown. Birthday wishes. Live it up. Birthday girl. Party time. So this will be good for my daughter's birthday pictures. Took lots of birthday pictures. Then I got this haunted uh, sticker set. So lots of uh, trick or treating. Ghosts, very scary costumes. So I might use these for her layouts for her Halloween. She was a chicken this year. So it was really cute and adorable. And then this one's called Christmas Time. And this one's really cute and pretty. It says, I love Christmas time. It's got a Santa. It's kind of like the olden looking, like, I used to have, uh, like, oh, those labels that you would print out, the tags or whatever you'd put on the Christmas gifts and stuff. It reminds me of those when I was younger. And then I got this one. This one's called Boy Oh Boy. It's called Boys Unite. Boys are the best. Guys, hanging with the guys. Figure if I have a little boy eventually in the future or for our godson or uh, just boy, period. Like, because I've taken pictures with my godson too. So, um, this will come in handy. Then I got grab this one. This one's called You're Invited. And it's combo stickers. You got alphas along here. I don't know, you can barely see the alpha, but um, it says party, enjoy every day, anything but ordinary, celebrate the everyday moments, love your fabulous self. Then I grabbed this one. This one's called Toy Box. And it's, you're the apple of my eye. My grandma always says that, so I love that. And then best ever. And then you got alphas along here. And all these cute little stickers here. So, grab that one. And then this one is absolutely adorable. It's called Sweet Moments. Find joy every day. Beautiful wonder. And just, I love this. This is beautiful here. Don't quit your daydream. Enjoy life, eat cake, create something beautiful. Cake is my happy place. So I thought that was absolutely gorgeous. The colors and everything. Oh. And then I got this one. This one's called Safari. And it's got an alpha over here. You got lions, tigers, hear me roar. So we went to uh, Black Pine Animal Sanctuary near us. It's like an hour away maybe. Um, and then plus we've gone to the zoo a couple times this year, so this I thought would look really good in her albums, so, <coughs> excuse me, alright, this one's called Penny Emporium, whenever possible choose adventure, find adventure, and then you got alphas over here, and this is just like, like olden turn, olden type look. And I really like it, like a vintage -y look. So I thought these were pretty. I like the color, the purple and the blues. Purple is one of my favorite colors. Then I grabbed this one. This one's called Madeline. And then you got alphas down here. Then you got all these beautiful stickers here. And I'm not sure these might be like washi. Yeah, like this one's like a tag. It's got like a tag type end on it. I don't know if you guys can see that. 
uh, life lesson, wonderful, original, my happy place, little things, follow your heart. So I like that one. All right, one more after this one, I think. This one's called Beautiful Dreamer. And I thought that was cute with the key and the little watch on here. And just like, it's like really cool looking. So I grabbed that one. I like the movie, the film strips here. I thought that was pretty. Just like the other one. All right, last but not least. This one's called Altitude. This one has alphas on the side here. And then it's got like a cup of tea, um, like snowflakes, snowball fight, winter. So this one will be good for snow time whenever my daughter is outside and I can take pictures. So this winter. So that's what I got at Scrapbooking for Less. And again, that is their Black Friday sale. And it's going on right now. So be sure to check that out. I've gotten quite a few packages the past couple days. I got this one and then I got the Santoro book and then I went to HSN. They had a craft day on Monday and I happened to call in that day to work because I uh, took a, a little mental health break and me and my hubby stayed home and kind of got stuff done around the house. So I didn't realize it was craft day on HSN. So that could be a good thing, could be a bad thing. I paid for the most part. I only bought one thing and I will hopefully be have I will hopefully have it up set up in my room here soon. But um here's what I ended up getting. Ta da My very first Ot light. I have been wanting a lamp in my room for a while now. Because all I have right now is this little inky dinky little light thing and my husband goes to sleep early so when he goes to sleep early I don't have time to craft and I can't craft because I don't want the overhead light on so to bug him so I got an hot light I figured that'd help me late at night and plus it's portable so I like that part so I could take it to my crops if I want the cord wraps around underneath and it has an extra outlet too so I can easily plug in my phone in to charge it so it's called the Craft Caddy Lamp, and it was only like $8 a month for the FlexPay, so only $40 on HSN, which I didn't think was a bad deal because these things could be quite pricey. So I finally got myself one, and I can't wait to set it up and see how it looks and see how it works, and I will be sure to let you guys know how that goes. So uh, stay tuned. I will be sure to show you guys my Christmas cards when I get them done, and anything else that I end up doing this year. I'm hoping to get some Christmas presents done and share those with you guys. So please subscribe to my channel if you have not. And please comment down below if you guys would like to see anything else or if uh, you guys uh, have any comments at all. Thanks for watching and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.